Hey, homer hanging on my neck. The bracelet matches a set. My brother Nanny's ting the dollar. Stop all that back and forth over the net. My mama wish I would've went corporate. She wish I would've went exec. I still turn to a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprinters to Quebec. Cherie, who am on back? They only giving niggas plus one, so I never pull up to the Met. You know I gotta bring the set. You know I gotta bring the G block. You know I gotta bring. Hey, hey, y'all, what's T? It's your girl Vana, and uh. I know I've been wondering what I've been doing with T. So now here is where you guys will see what's going on with me in my day to day and kind of, you know, what's T. Um, as far as my life, me and Savage moved to Atlanta. Yay. Cute sound effects. Um, LA was just disgusting. There's no shade to anybody i love it there but it's nasty the food is nasty and the culture is just what it was just not there for me so i brought my ass back to what i know the a. and um i've been here for like a year it's time it's time it's time um so far what have i done here <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to um Nay and Jay because they put me on this YouTube. We you know Shabab Shabum. But while you guys are watching me, make sure you guys are shopping with me. This is not on my website, but that's because I made a limited number. Shout out to Jay for the crop idea. Shout out to my girl Jay. <laughs> but um yeah, shop with me. I'm about to have a new drop in like a month or two, so Make sure you guys get with it. It's the materials, A1. The quality you're paying is top notch for a top notch, you know. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I've just been in Atlanta focusing on me. I feel like LA is, like, such a drainer. Like, it'll drain everything. And, like, even hiking every day, I was, like, emotionally, like, I hate it here. It was doing too much. So, I moved to the A. And, yeah. As far as that show goes, I'm no longer a part of that franchise at all. Not that I ever really was. I was a guest star for real for real. I just happened to turn that bitch up. Um, yeah, I'm off that. I feel like that was crazy. The edits were crazy. The people were crazy. And I'm not about to sit around and be a part of that. Why y'all try to have the same narrative as, you know? Like, when I was a kid, like, 18, that fighting shit was cool. But, like, I'm a grown-ass woman. I'm going to protect myself by all means necessary. And for y'all to edit it, like, I damn near <sighs> attacked the bitch is crazy. So, I actually quit. And tragedy, but I'm not about to be a part of no shit like that. Blessings to them folks, but... I wouldn't sit with them on a regular day. So I'm not about to sit and film with them on the motherfucking, you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers is selling your soul and I won't be a part of it. But yeah, so that's what that is giving. So I don't know, maybe one day I'll have my own show or some shit like that. Maybe my friends will one day get bored and tired of looking at bullshit on TV and maybe we'll make our own show. <coughs> Plan, but I'm so serious. But um, yeah, my number one priority right now is just me, my brand, growing as like a person, as a daughter, as a sister, all types of shit. Um, yeah, I'm just out here. My vibe right now is just living life. Oh my god, I traveled so much this summer. It was a vibe. Oh, and for all the questions regarding like, do I have a sugar daddy? Do I have a loan? All that. The answer is no. And that's what I'll be doing in like further videos, answering you guys' questions. If you guys have questions, make sure you write your questions below so I can answer them in like my next couple videos. Because the narratives are ridiculous. I never had a loan, y'all. You can Google this shit. If somebody got a PPP loan, guess what you can do? Google this shit. That is some, that was beneath me. I wasn't doing that shit, even though
Biden, if you run it back, I won't be slow this time. I'm gonna pick my feet up and hit that bitch. I'm gonna be on it. But yeah, I that was I was not a part of that thing. I was just really out here grinding, getting money, and for them to have a lot of black women producers, for them to try to deteriorate a young black woman for just being fly and had loving nice shit and trying to make me feel bad about that, y'all can actually go to hell. Okay, okay. So yeah, that's that. Um, but yeah, life's great. I got a tattoo for my haters. Life's just been great. Like, um, I'll pin like some videos attached of like some shit that I've been doing the couple months of me being here. But like, life, oh, it's great. Oh look, I died savage. His his color's kind of going away, but savage. Say hey to the people. Say hey, wake up, child. Look at my sleepy child. Look, I'm mom's favorite. He is. Look at my cuddle bug. Look, making noise and shit, baby. Look at him, he's blue. But I had this, I'm taking his color out right now so I can dye him another color because he's so blue. Why do we match, Savage? Get because he is blue. I gotta wait for it to fade away. Look at his ears. I gotta wait for it to fade away before I can dye him another color. I love him. So yeah, for y'all thinking like, oh, she was pregnant, she had to leave. I am not Egypt them. Okay, I am 24. I'm living my best life. I'm not worried about no baby. I'm not worried about no nigga. I'm worried about me and, you know what I'm saying, getting money like I'm used to. You know what I'm saying? And then as far as y'all with this whole, um, your dad gives you money, did y'all? If y'all are really close viewers y'all will see he was telling me listen i didn't kick the little girl out i don't play with her like that he don't play with me like that like <laughs> i'm out here fighting for my life so yeah if y'all love me y'all fuck with me support me <laughs> the good vibe baby get with it again oh yeah it's me i'm thick as shit atlanta that's one thing i will say about atlanta atlanta got me thick as hell i'm also going to put the foods in the food places that I be eating at. Maybe I'll do a video about that as well. Like me going out to eat. Because one thing I'm going to do is eat like I look amazing. Terrific. Ain't that right, Savage? Yeah. Beside the little fish fillet I had today. That's one thing that's always going to stay on my roster. They don't. Hey. Hey. One thing about it. They don't close. They be open. And they be putting the tartar sauce on extra when I ask them to. So please, um, with the occasional fish fillet, besides that, I eat like I look amazing. Y'all can say what y'all want about McDonald's, but it never gave me no shit. How about you? Yeah, my vibe right now is just living life. Um, I'm on some like artistic, free-spirited shit. You know, like I'm just trying to really find myself because I feel like when you grow up in this fucked up ass industry shit and i'm not gonna say i grew up in it but like being 16 17 that's kind of like your prime years of life that was a lot and that was like what the fuck is life but now <laughs> now i kind of had this year to like reset and figure out what i want and what i want to do that tv shit is not it i know y'all be like growing up like i want to yo are you serious right now i know y'all be growing up like i want to be on tv i want to do this no, do your own shit, build your own shit, build your own empire and just let everything fall into place naturally because that TV shit is, they are, they sell their souls. I just want to let y'all know for pennies, for pennies, like this big, it'd be crazy, right Savage? Not even a dime, but yeah, so my vibe right now is really just living life. Um... I'm being a big sister and all types of shit, a mom and shit. I don't be having time for all that extra, but if y'all want more content from me, it's <laughs> it really gonna be hard, but like just drop some comments of stuff that y'all would like me to see and videos y'all would like for me to post. And yeah, in this upcoming year, I'm just doing a lot of different shit. Like I've been like working on music, which is totally like some high drunk shit to do, but hey. If you don't got nothing else to do, do something. You're only young once. Kinda 
I'm feeling life out. Like, like I said, LA is the worst. Y'all don't want to move to LA. Y'all don't want to move to LA. Y'all don't want to be on reality TV. If you never learned two things from me, you don't want to be on reality TV. <clears throat> Excuse me. And you don't want to live in LA. Boring and boring. If you're going to move somewhere with palm trees, go like overseas or... Miami. Miami's the place to be, baby. I don't want to leave. <laughs> but I got to go right now. Hey, hey. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And hit the bell button to see all of my videos. Okay, bye. I stopped this shit. Mm -hmm.